Yo, what up, people? We are back in the course with armor, <laughs> and I've actually I've been itching to get back into this series ever since I played Armored Core 2. These games are actually pretty fun, but the thing is, like, I've never been a huge like mech fan and so while the cover art for these games looks absolutely dope i never really like saw them at the shop and decided oh you know what's a giant robot fighting game sure i'll buy it like you know it just never really crossed my mind but now because of armored core 6 announcement i've been getting into the series and honestly like these games are pretty cool i mean they're hard but they're pretty cool and would you look at that armored core 3 actually has music in the main menu let's start a new game this game is set on earth and there's this ai the controller that just decides stuff for, it's kind of like the president but it's an either it's some fucked up shit. yo we're jumping off a goddamn plane straight into a city and my analog sticks actually work well, I mean, one of the sticks actually work. Anyway, let's just go back to Armored Core 2 controls. And we actually have a buddy this time that's not here just to watch, like, Strung the Pervert. <laughs> but these controls, though, I, I gotta switch back to what I was using on Armored Core 2, man. This is just confusing me again. Also, I really like this environment. The city? This thing is kinda dope, not gonna lie. Yo, and... Oh, fuck! Cool stuff. Do I have a secondary? Yeah, I still have the missiles. Cool. All nice. Units destroyed. Ugh, man, this was much easier than Armored Core 2, goddamn. Probably due to the fact that I actually know what I'm getting myself into this time. But anyway, so we have new mail. The controller? Yo. This message to notify citizen. Uh, I, I, I guess that's me. Of their authentication as a raven, which includes the right to operate ACs in support of activities registered through global cortex very nice anyway what missions do we have available that's zero credits on the reward and this is 11k and employee standoff they've modified the factory's mts for combat yo this guy's modified construction machines for war <laughs> the fucking chad workers all right can't be too hard but i forgot to change the fucking co well i better get used to it then yes they did Bitch. Man, these future protests are really getting out of hand. That's all of them. Yo, that's all of them? Bro, I... I did... That. <laughs> Holy shit, that was easy. Look at that. We actually made money this time. Fantastic. Good work, Raven. We appreciate your help in murdering honest workers and satisfied with their lives. No problem. That's what I'm here for. Anyway, what else we have? Yo, yo, that's another map. Third layer, industrial research. Let's check it out. Secure the mine. Sure. I mean, no, not sure, get out of here, I, I gotta switch the controls, man. Turn left, turn right, move left, and move right, yes. Also, by the way, I am playing this on the PCSX2 emulator. Currently at six times its native resolution, I could probably bump this even higher, honestly. If the performance starts to complain about something, I'll lower it back down again. Anyway. Destroy all forces occupying the facility. Yes, I shall. Uh, well, that, I, I don't know if I, I mean, I'll, I can try, but I'm not gonna make any promises, you know, I mean, that's, <laughs> I'll, I'm like, I'm riding a giant robot over here, like, I'll see what I can do about it, alright? Open up, yo, got just like that, yo, I just got in here, bro, chill the fuck out, alright? Hey, yo, lift up, man, I'm already overheating, come on, what the hell, bro, I gotta buy some better parts, I'll come to this dude, hey, yo. There's no one up there. Fuck! Don't destroy this one. They don't have a lot of health. I just learned you can go from a boost into a jump if you double tap X, which is pretty nice. And z hey oh, switch to the fucking missiles and boom! Come on, bro! Three missiles, four, bro! How much health does this man have? Get out of here, bro! Yo! We still have our fucking laser blades. Uh, and so. Very nice. Those things go down pretty quick. Yo. Yeah. And that should be the last one. Bro! God damn, am I getting good at this? <laughs> I 
God damn, let's go. That was nice. Also, in these games, you gotta pay for the ammunition you spend, for your repairs, and the special deduction is because I wasn't supposed to destroy mining equipment, I believe, but you know, shit happens. I mean, it was only 300 credits, I'm sure they'll live. We got a mission to defend the arena. It's not paying me anything, though but I'm sure. Oh, it's like a terrorist attack on the arena. All right, we gotta protect it. Wait, 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 wait. I, I am, I am getting paid based on the number of enemy units destroyed. Also, I wonder if I have to pay for the ammo spent, would it be better for me to, for example, only use my arm unit instead of the missiles and stuff like that, if possible? Bro, how the fuck do I dodge those missiles, man? Is that guy too far for the lock-on? Well, not anymore. Let's go. I know I'm overheating. Shut up, man. All right, there's a bunch of guys in here. Yo, let's go. Did that hit? I think it did. Let me check my... Now, nah, yeah, that's definitely hitting me, bro. Looks like you could use a hand. This man is helping me. Let's go. We got a buddy on our team. I mean, that's good. I'm defending the arena. Like, this is a place for all ravens. So, you know, we should definitely have more people out here helping. Hey, oh, that missile went right over me. Come on, bro, I need some better boosters. I want to boost for longer, man. Yo, what the hell is he shooting? Holy shit, I want that gun. This man got a full-on plasma shotgun or something and missiles, which, by the way, I also have. Heyo, and heyo, and heyo. All right, he was already dead, but whatever. I just spent some ammo. Look, if we kill enough of them, this won't be a problem. All right, I mean, we still made 19k and then lost more than half of that on repairs and ammunition, but that's fine. Look, it's still positive, all right? We're on positive balance. It's fine. This time we're gonna go into the 824 super highway. Seems fun. And there's a, a vehicle with a bomb on it. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about it, but... I guess we're gonna find out. There's a lot of blur like in these intros, but I, that's probably just because of the emulator, I assume. Anyway, death target. Yo, bro, that transport is super small compared... Raven, clear path for me. Bro, uh, sorry. I was adjusting the camera, man. Right, so how do I destroy this exactly? I guess I just have to shoot it. Yeah, good stuff. We're clearing the highway. See? Doing our civic duty. By the way, this highway looks pretty sick. And like, just the overall variety in missions is actually pretty good. Another thing that's pretty good is the soundtrack. I didn't really mention it before, but if you're into like electronic music, this thing actually got some bangers. Anyway, I think I've done a nice job leaving area. I mean, sorry, I gotta look at my map to see we'll where the area is. Good job, yeah, Raven. well, goddamn, did I just complete every single mission they gave me up until I'm now? Saved. Holy shit. I'm feeling confident right now. Come on, just give me Armored Core 6, man. Speaking of Armored Core 6, I gotta try some PS3 Armored Cores. And from what I understand, people like uh, Armored Core 4 answer a lot. And it's a very fast game. Armored Core 4 was also when Miyazaki made his debut as a director. Although I know he had something to do with Last Raven as well. But anyway, you guys have been dropping a ton of information about these games on the comments. And I really appreciate it. Because these games are pretty technical. And there's a bunch of stats and stuff that do different things. And honestly, if I didn't have a bunch of people explaining to me how this shit works in the comments, I probably wouldn't be having this much fun with it. Just saying. I mean, it, it can be kind of a hard series to get into. Especially with his PS2 controls. Although there's like two games I think in the PS2 that actually use analog sticks. Nexus and Last Raven I believe. Also in this game you can choose consorts which are like helpers pretty much. We got Cold Heart, Huntress, Apple Boy. Yo I remember this Apple Boy. This man has an AC. Fragile. And yo my boy gay those that... <laughs> Although the better they are, the bigger the cut they take as well. But I mean, I'm pretty confident I can do this by myself. All right, so I guess I have to protect these things, right? Yeah, all right, sure. We still don't have power. It's fine, don't worry, I'm here. Yo, these dudes are kind of big, not gonna lie, they're a little intimidating. And hey -oh. 
Yo, I actually just realized the energy blade spends energy. Well, I mean, it is an energy blade. I guess it makes sense. Is it man that? Yes, it is. Second wave, let's go. Uh, I think someone just died. What? I can't do this by myself. Famous last words for the people I was supposed to protect, that is. Total credit 61k. You know what? Let's go to the shop. Except you don't actually have a shop. Or, I mean, maybe it's in the garage. Oh, shop. Here we go. All right, cool. So you guys told me that the base of your armored core is pretty much your legs. Not only they affect how you move, and there are different types of legs, like the reverse joints, the quad legs, and stuff like that. And there's some floaty guys as well. But all leg parts have a maximum weight. And whatever you choose to put on top of your AC can't exceed the maximum weight that your legs can carry. Or bad things will happen. I, I'm not sure what that means. That was just how it was explained to me. Rapid fire machine gun. I could buy this and... Uh, sure, let, let's try a new weapon. Assembly and... Uh, wait, I... I can remove but Oh, where you go up and down. Oh, bro, this is actually a lot better. Like, this is a nice-ass garage, honestly. Uh, yeah, I don't have any other legs. These are the boosters. These are the ones I bought, right? Boost power is better. Everything else is kind of worse, but whatever, it's fine. The FCS, I believe it's my lock-on system. And where is my... Oh, the weapon, right. Right-hand weapon. Attack power 215. This is a lot weaker, but I'm hoping it's faster. Although it only has like 350 ammo, so it can't be too fast. Otherwise, I'm just gonna run out of ammo real quick. Anyway, let's get a paint job going. Maybe the red, I like that. And you can also drop some emblems in your armored core. All right, that's good. Cool. Yo, nightmare, that looks sick. The shark too. Yo, that, we got some sick ass emblems over here. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, so I will probably take the nightmare. It goes with my red paint job, but where does the emblem go? Like, oh, it's on the shoulder, I see. All right, that's cool. By the way, what's cockpit customization? Wait a minute, change panel? Enemy heat, enemy wet. Bro, you can add stuff. All right, I mean, that's cool i i don't want all of this on my screen but that is nice and you can change the color of it too all right that's cool but i want to try my machine gun though and apparently we have more <laughs> honest workers to murder and people complain about the job market today god damn yo these boosters are hella fast uh gas jenner do i just destroy this Oh, all right. I just have to disable them with the interact button. That's nice. I see a lock. Yo, it does. Bro, I like this machine gun. I am now officially out of ammo. Can I like increase my ammo supplies or something? I mean, I guess that's kind of how they balance things. But now I only have my missiles and the energy blade. Get out of here, loser. Destroy escaping MT. 12,000 credits. Looks good. Yo, what's up, boy? Let's fucking... <laughs> Bro, don't let him escape, he said. <laughs> God damn. Yo, what do you mean took the bait? Bro, get out of here. Oh, come on, really? You fucking get out of here, bro. God damn. Bro, fuck you. I want I want this one. All right. That we good? We good, bro? Raven rank S, bro. That guy didn't stand a chance. Safeguard water supply 20,000 credits. Objective disable the canister. Enemy forces are empties and helicopters. That's fine. Although mission sometimes can have some unexpected turn of events. Is this a goddamn jumping puzzle mission? Uh, all right, cool. Uh, can I just get my ass in here? No, I cannot. Where am I even supposed to go? Really, is there? Am I supposed to find an entrance somewhere? Shit! No. Go, 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 go. All right, cool. I think this is an entrance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yo, bitch, get the hell out of here. Yeah, this doesn't look like it leads anywhere, though. I gotta go check that thing out. And... Uh, 
Bro, that was right on the edge. <laughs> oh, again. Bro, all right, just, just small jump. All right, cool. Gate six. Right. Gate six. Um, by gate six, do you mean I have to go back to the first gate that was locked? They actually just gave you a goddamn platforming mission. Ugh. All right, that's good. I gotta make it to the first one, I believe. I hope it is. I, <laughs> I don't want to be flying over there and then turns out that's actually not where you needed to go. Let's go. And this should be it. All right, good. Die, please. Thank you. And activate this thing. Bro, what the fuck? These goddamn helicopters are ruining my health. I don't even know where gate 5 actually is. Is it this one? Should... Uh... I... Look, I, I don't know. Maybe... No, wait, this is gate 7. Are you fucking kidding me, man? <laughs> so there's still another gate. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe this is gate 5 and... If I press this... So is that gate 7, the one that opened? Yes, that was actually gate 7. Guess it's safe to jump down. Uh, any enemies around here? Yo. Bro, who the hell just shot me, man? God damn, there's things on the ceiling. Bro, I can't shoot that one. Yes, I can. All right, nice. I'm not leaving area. Shut up. Lane. Oh. Please tell me that's the end of the mission. I have 957 health. Oh, bro. God damn those helicopters outside, man. But we made it. I mean, our finances took a dent with those AC repairs, but it's fine. We only lost, like, more than half of our reward, but, you know, it's fine. I mean, let's try the arena. We have Adio over here. And also, he has a different emblem that I didn't have. Can I kill this man and take his emblem? That would be cool. Yo, this screen is also pretty nice. Ruin? Yo, let's go. Yo, this map is actually pretty nice. And I hope I have enough ammo to kill this guy because, uh, like, bro, I have to be very efficient with the use of this machine gun. It's like either all bullets land or you're just not killing whatever you're trying to kill. Bro, I only have 20 fucking bullets left. That's not great. Yep, I'm out of ammo, but he doesn't have a whole lot of health. I'ma just finish this man off with some missiles. Hello! Alright, nice. But yeah, I mean, the, the machine gun on the arena, kinda dangerous. Let me check the shop. I don't have a lot of parts, but could I potentially buy a better machine gun? The hell is that? That's like a pistol, right? That's a sniper rifle. God damn, 995 attack power? Bro, that'll punch a hole in anything. Balanced attack power and speed, but that's 29k. High ammo capacity machine gun. This bitch can take a hundred rounds, but it costs 74k. Bro, I am broke as fuck. All right, we're on a timer. We gotta destroy this bridge, which I think I've been on before, actually. But it's fine. Who the fuck is shooting at me? Yo, that thing sounds beefy. But eat this machine gun, bro. Target. Let's go. Just plant this. And, man, it's gotta be back. I'm sure of it. Oh, I can't see shit. All right, I'm good. Uh, yo, where is this thing, man? Where is the target? Oh, my God, it's back there. Come on, there is time. There is time. Run. Just forget about the explosions. Come on. Oh. Let's go! Never lose hope, boys. Although it did cost my entire fucking wallet and I still had to pay him back 15 bucks. Also, there's some bars over there near the corporation names. And I know, like, those corporations are the ones that are giving us the missions. Like, for example, this requester is Crest. So there's gotta be, like, some sort of faction standing system or something. Not sure how it affects you exactly. Maybe they give you some discounts on parts or something like that. Which, by the way, are also all tied to a specific company. Brrr, and brrr. Yo. AC crossback identified. Oh, bro, we have a fucking enemy AC. That guy looks fucking beefy. Where is this man exactly? I gotta start saving my machine gun ammo. Those tanks take two missiles. That is fine. Found this man. Yo, wait a minute, did our rockets just hit each other mid-air? That was kind of sick. 
Anyway, switch to the machine gun. Let's go. Fuck him up. Come on. I'm not sure how much health this guy has, but it's probably gonna... Destroy. Yeah, yeah. well, there go my ammo reserves. And... Ooh, no, 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 don't die. Please don't, 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 don't. Lock on to this man. Just keep shooting. This man's throwing mines and shit. Like, what the hell? This man is fully equipped, bro. I'm gonna die right here. I have 25 health. I need some extra sensitivity. Like, I need to turn faster. And, well, great. And would you look at that? We're in the red. I feel like I'm sort of getting the hang of the gameplay, but there's also, like, a certain management element to these games that I... <laughs> Like, I don't see myself getting through an entire campaign right now. Let's check out another arena. We have a parking lot. Seems a tropical forest. Yo, nah, let, let me check that out. Yo, bro, look at this thing. This arena actually looks pretty sick. The trees. There's a bunch of fog, too. Can I go up? Yo, that thing looks fucking crazy. That's nice. 2,000 credits for that guy. Let me just check out Strasbourg 2 because I want to see... God damn, that's a big boy. But anyway, I want to see that parking lot stage. Yeah, we actually have cars and stuff in here. I mean, I guess that's what you usually have in parking lots, but <laughs> I don't know. It's, just, it's pretty cool seeing this in the game. Hey, oh, switch to the rockets. Where is this man? Yeah. Oh. Oh. All right, my lock-on is actually pretty fast now, ha! You thought you can't get me with that thing? So That's probably gonna hit a column somewhere. Bro, this fucking machine gun is so nice. Where is this man? And he's out. And so is my machine gun, bro. I finished him and my ammo at the same time let's go no matter what armored core game you pick up like the the formula is very similar although some of them will have different parts that will allow you to do some different stuff with your mech but overall like they play in a very familiar fashion to one another which i guess it's a good thing if you like these games and the way they play so this was armored core 3 hope you guys liked it peace <laughs>